What is going on everybody? My name is Pete, but you probably already knew that, but in case you didn't, you guys are watching the one and only Paid to Drive, and of course, Paid to Drive Vlogs, day number 1357, coming at you. Hope you're all having a great one out there. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you should definitely be subscribed to this channel with all notifications turned on. That's right, get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button, set the bell to all notifications so you're always notified when I post something new. And of course, hit that like button down below. Just lets YouTube know, doing a good job. I'll give you a second to do that. And in the meantime, let's jump into the email. Triple Lindy. Thornton Mellon style. I like that. So this comes from my buddy, James Ruffalo. He's been watching the channel, I think over three years now, right? So James, let me know. So listen to this. He goes, dear Pete, as you know, I always believed in Grubhub. So do I. I still love doing Grubhub and DoorDash. However, I had to pick the most frustrating day and I went to a McDonald's for an $11 order. And I get there and I couldn't mark arrived on the app because my signal was bad. And I was getting ready to leave the order and it got reassigned because it stated that I wasn't moving from my other location, even though I was waiting at the McDonald's for my order. And they said, your order's ready. So first off, that's incredibly frustrating because it's like you're doing your job, but the technology can't keep up with what you're doing whether it's a signal issue or an app issue or the server problem, you know, there's oh, it's like, there's always something to inconvenience things, you know? Uh, so they, so he goes, so now I have to leave after I just drove to get there. So then I take DoorDash orders, you know, to fill in, fill in my time and others to fill in my time at this point. I was already low on money, so I didn't care about taking the dollar per mile. I just wanted to make my goal for today, even though I hate that. So basically, I had to take a mile's lost, a mile's loss. Uh, then I get later on another order on Grubhub, and, and little did I know, it's an order for Denny's. So I go to pick up the order and drop it off. Smooth transaction. Let me just stop for a second. I can't, we don't have Denny's in my market, so I can't fully relate. Um, but I will say this, I have heard such horror stories about Denny's. Let me know in the chat or the comments if you don't mind picking up um, Denny's orders. Uh, so, but he was lucky, smooth transaction. So then I get more DoorDash orders and shut off Grubhub. And then DoorDash slows down, so I turn back on Grubhub. And then I get more DoorDash orders. Uh, oh, wait, wait, and then, then DoorDash slowed down, so I turn on Grubhub and, and, and Uber Eats. And then a nice big, out, big payout came on for Grubhub for $15 at a restaurant that was only two minutes away from me. And I knew the customer's address, so I knew the person and I knew that I would be getting a good tip out of it. I drive towards the restaurant and then I get stuck by a train by El Mirage in Arizona. For those of you that are familiar with the Phoenix market, it's fired an area called Route 60 Grand Avenue. Anyway, I waited there for a good 15 minutes. I called the restaurant to let them know that I was running late. They said, no problem. And the customer said, no problem. And even Grubhub on driver support said, no problem. So I'm waiting and waiting and waiting for the train to go by. And then the order gets reassigned to a different person. I call Grubhub just to have them give me the runaround and back to square one and just have them say, sorry for the inconvenience. I miss the old driver care when they used to be able to just reassign me the order or just pay me for it anyways, because they knew it wasn't my fault. I really wish that they can treat the drivers better. Sincerely, James. Whew, that was a mouthful. Originally, when I read that, I thought he said he was struck by the train instead of stuck by the train. I was like, oh my God, you know, because that's never a good situation. But unlike, you know, not unlike, just like the other apps like DoorDash and Uber Eats, Grubhub is not perfect. Um, I think when it comes to stability, I think Grubhub is the better app. Um, Uber Eats is pretty good too, but DoorDash seems to be the one that has the most issues. But again, I think that's just server capacity problems and a bunch of other stuff. I just think it's just not stable enough. Um, so with that being said, it's incredibly unfortunate that he was having signal problems and that the $15 order was taken away from him. Because it's true, back 
couple of years ago when you were assigned a driver specialist or when you had a driver care, which was pretty on point, they would just be able to rearrange things and give you orders or take something out of your queue. And it seems like drivers are having issues with that. Luckily in my market, we don't have these issues too much because everything really isn't too spread out. Uh, and if you know your market, like I do very well, I can keep myself in a designated area by just, you know, cherry picking the orders that I want. So what are your thoughts on this, everybody? Let me know in the chat. Let me know in the comments down below. And remember, if you ever want to send me anything to read for a video or just have a question, email it to paid to drive stories at gmail.com best place to reach me but for a faster response you can message me on the patreon app there's a link in the description down below click show more or the link in the in the pinned top comment in the comment section um download uh, download the app and sign up or go to patreon.com slash paid to drive um and also as a perk i will shout you out in all my new videos and and you'll get moderator privileges in the premiere chats or whenever i go live and when you hear your name called, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name. So we got Samantha Michaels, Brian Pomeroy, Heidi Barnes, Joe Valerio, Kurt Paul, Lee Peacock, Tulsa Todd, William Boudreau, Laura Love, Agus, Tom Perry, Alan G. Van Horn, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Haviland, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Justin Case, Lulu Laura, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Freisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Joyce Hine, Brian Richardson, Jenny Thomas, John Bonacci, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacy Miller, Terrence Pacheco, and the, the Valerie Brown. That's right, everybody. So yeah, if you want to sign up, links in the description down below. And of course, please start saving money on your gas today. Download the free app called Get Upside. Link is in the description down below. It works on any kind of phone, okay? All you have to do is download it for free, all right? Go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside gas app, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside, links in the description. Make sure to download it today. Seriously, guys, it's a great app, all right? Also, boom. Live to drive, drive to live. Got this is actually one of my favorite designs. Uh, there's lots more just like it and some other stuff at paytodrivestore.com. Everything's on sale all the time. Different colors, sizes, different designs. Get your hoodies, your, your t shirts, hoodies, and goodies at paytodrivestore.com. Go check it out. And if you made it to the end of this video, simply leave a comment saying end 635, E N D 635. And uh, of course, get started right now. Hit that free red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications. So you're always notified when I post something new. And don't forget to hit that like button. Would really, really appreciate it. Just tells YouTube I'm doing a good job. All right. So until next time, get that money, get that honey, keep hustling and keep bustling. And we'll see you next time right here on Paid to Drive and Paid to Drive Vlogs. Be well, drive safe, and take care of yourselves and each other.